am back again today. Feeling lighter than usual. It's funny how life does that sometimes. Sometimes it's just all a matter of perspective, isn't it? Just what you're thinking, what you're feeling. You've gotta have hope. You've gotta be willing to just throw down. Try to make things better. I know no one's here for personal speech. I mean, no one's here at all. <laughs> That's okay. I'm here for myself. And if anyone shows up to chat, I'm happy with that. My god, this piano really does sound like Honey Pop. <laughs> I think it's that little bit that. Da -da 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 -da. It's like lifted straight from Honey Pop, I swear. Ugh, whatever. Now. Let's see. Uh, I think I have one of those. Actually, well, if I hit L, will it tell me if I have one or not? Yes, okay. Pokeball shows up. Good. I know I have Hoppet. Now, the problem I'm facing at this point is I don't think I have anything that's strong against Bug. And the first gym leader is a Bug type. And Pugs are generally weak, so it might not be that much of a problem. But it is a little concerning that I don't have anything that's actually effective against Bug. I'd rather be able to go at them, go at the train leader, or the, the, the train leader. Alright, I haven't caught a Mareep yet, so let's catch a Mareep. Also, what I've noticed is, for how little battling I'm doing, my levels are pretty much spot on to where you'd think they would be at this point, aren't they? Like, this Mareep was level 9, I'm level 10. That's like perfectly spot on. Which tells me that the game is actually designed to allow for this, because most modern games. Most modern games will actually are designed so that any optional content is truly optional. Anything you can do that you don't need to do, the game is designed to be beaten fairly e easily without you doing it. You know what? Whatever. Let's do it. If you get it, you get it. <clears throat> So the fact that I'm actually at a pretty good level for this point, like not too high, not too low, I'm actually hovering about right where the uh, wild Pokemon are, and I think the trainers too, is that they absolutely plan for you to not fight many battles. That's kind of, they designed the game to be played that way. Which is, you know, it should be expected, but it is kind of a surprise, because... I think most people play Pokemon expecting to grind their ass off. But that's not really a thing in this one. Or the Sword and Shield. What the hell is happening to the wall? Oh my god, that wouldn't even pop in. It was like sliding into place. I haven't seen us anything like that since the PlayStation 1. <laughs> Good lord. Anything else gonna do it? Oh, oh, yeah, it's still going. So, oh. Whoa. Holy crap. So. It's funny, it doesn't look like the textures are changing much. Oh, I see what's happening. As the wall becomes more detailed, it takes on the more jagged edges. It's not as flat anymore. But it's not designed, but the textures are moving with the, like, morphing wall. So it looks like the entire wall is just made of clay. I, oh, crap. I don't think I've ever seen a game do that before. Like, I know games do that. Like, the, pop, the texture popping and stuff happens. Usually it's a snappy pop-in. It's a sudden pop-in. They don't usually, like, go all wibbly-wobbly like that. What are you? Do I have you? I don't think I have you. Now, 
look at this. Again, level 10. My Pokemon are all level 10 to 12. So. Mastiff. Yes. Hmm. Stupid dog. It's in your box. Alright. Now, I guess the question I should be asking at this point is, do I have anything that would be good against Bug? Because, let's see, my current team... Button... Isn't ground weak to Bug? Might be. Uh, Louie has Wing Attack. Which is probably the best attack I have right now against Bugs. Uh, hop to it is half flying, but it's also half grass. So grass is weak to bug, so it's going to be neutral. Buggy. Is bug strong against itself? I don't think it is. Piglet is neutral, obviously, and then Nada Chew is neutral. Nothing is just straight strong against bug. Is anything in here? Like, Birdie would be good, but it's a little under leveled. I don't think I can get it up to level high, up to high enough level quick enough. Uh, also too low level. Yeah, I would need to... Should I replace what I'm talking about with one of these for later? Should I, like, pop in Birdie? Because now that I think about it, I don't really have anything strong against Grass, either. In fact, half my team is weak to Grass. Like, Button dies to Grass. Louie dies to Grass. Buggy can beat Grass. Nodachu is not very good against grass, though. Hmm. So, yeah, that's actually not... <laughs> uh, yeah. This isn't great. I might have to just lean on Louie. It's gonna be tough, but... That's all I've got unless I can, like, power level birdie. I I wonder how... Can you buy the experience stones? That's the thing I guess I should ask. Ranberry. Super potion. Alright, any new Pokemon? Just more of the... It's cowardly dogs? No. Oh, Makita. Nice. So, um... Maybe I should take out Birdie. I think I should, but what should I replace? Hop to it? Hop to it's not very good anyway. I don't think. Sleep powders. I mean. It can stall and slowly kill, I suppose. <laughs> That's a thing it can do. But, you know what? Uh, should I replace Piglet? Uh, this Piglet seems okay right now. Maybe I'll replace Hop to it with Birdie. Again, I don't need to be switching around Pokemon too much. Because if I do that, nothing is going to be strong enough to accomplish anything. Like if I'm constantly switching Pokemon in and out, their levels are going to get further and further behind. Is anything strong as fighting? Is this bug strong as fighting? I think it is. I just don't want him to one-hit sh one-shot birdie. I need Birdie's experience to go up fast, so that's why I put it in front. Oh, nice. Okay. Very good. Oh, 
to knock its health down a bit. Or at least I can stun it. That'd be good. That was an animation. I'm not sure what that was supposed to be. Oh, ha ha! Quick attack. Nice. Wait. Did Birdie just gain like three, two or three levels? Like he just dated and the Pokédex. I mean, it is literal. seeing an item. There it is. And the battle I was just staring at this glittering thing over here. Uh, I don't think there's anything else here, though. Level, is level 7 going to be good enough? I mean, it might. Yeah, it was only it wasn't level six before. I think it jumped up like skipped a level or two. Because yeah, I think it was level wasn't it like level three or four? So it doesn't show it going all the way up, which is probably good. What moves does it have right now? Whoops. There we go. Summary. Growl, peck. Oh, peck. That's gonna be good. Okay. Okay, that's not bad. If I get it, another battle or two. I just need one or two new Pokemon. Or a trainer. A trainer would work too. Experience candies. I'm not going to use those right now. I feel like they're going to be way more important later. Oh, there you go. Hey, where am I right now? <laughs> I think I've gone way off the path. Oh, this is one of those terrestrialized uh, caves, isn't it? What are you? Oh. I can catch you. I'm pretty sure it saw me. I'm not sure how off guard it is. Shit! Okay, we're not going this way. We're not going this way. <laughs> what the fuck? Why? Why is there a random level 25 Starly over here? Where am I? Did I am I going the wrong way? Wait, wait. Oh, it's down here. Okay, yeah, I'm going a little off the beaten path here. I probably should try not to. Hey, there's a happy deer around here somewhere. Yeah, that was... That was kind of lucky. Oh, uh, hmm. What are the odds these things are... High level too? You know what? I'm not going to try it. If I just start losing Pokemon to... God, that's wearily trippy. If I just start losing Pokemon left and right to stupid crap like that, I'm gonna lose it. Oh, and I've added a rule. If I white out entirely, it counts as a loss. I'm not gonna stop playing or start over anything. I do still want to play the game. But I will just count it as a loss, and at the end of this whole thing, assuming I get there, I'll just count up how many times I died. That's my solution here. My poor bag's full to bursting with ingredients. Here, let me share some with you. Whee! Sandwiches are best when you eat them outside. Try making some with the stuff I gave you. 
Hey, since you're here, want to have a picnic so you can rest up a little? Uh, okay. You and your Pokemon look like you're all full of energy. Come again any time. Okay. There's stuff down here. Ranberry, potion. Oh, more Mareeks. Shouldn't need to switch out, so hopefully Birdie here will get more experience for this. I wonder if I can just start chucking Pokeballs level 25 and catch it. Obviously, it's a huge risk to try that. so much glittery stuff around. I can't go toward the town because I'm looking for glittery stuff. Hey, experience candy. Nice. If I need to, I can throw some experience candy at Birdie. I haven't seen a single trainer on this path yet, have I? Hey, there's one. Speak of the devil. Your bug Pokemon? I will destroy them with my bird. That sounds like a good idea. Come here, kid. Peck your eyes out over and over again. I mean, you only have two eyes, so I can only do it twice, but it will be terrible for you. Alright, this should be good. Look at terrestrialize. Uh, does the terrestrialize make it normal or flying? I guess I can probably check. Nice. Youngster Roy. Oh, I bet I could have beat you if I'd evolved my Pokemon. Oh yeah, Krikatot does evolve, doesn't it? Mm. Oh, a bunch of Hoppips. Alright, so what is your Terra type? Uh, flying. Nice. Okay. So that would be even better for the gym. I can terrestrialize the flying and just mutilate everything with Peck. And as a backup, I have uh, Louie and his wing attack. Are you a trainer? You go to the academy, right? Do you know about Team Star? You are challenged by Angel the Courier. Angel the Courier sent out Saito. I'm still not sure if it's made of rubber or feathers. It bothers me. Hmm. That's a high-level Saito. This 
basically my best shot. I don't know if I outspeed it. Psyduck isn't very fast. I can't run for trainer battle. <laughs> Fuck! Did I just lose? Like entirely? The well, button's obviously not gonna do anything. My best bet is probably Louie. At least it's strong against the water pulse. Okay. Oh, this is still gonna be close. Oh my god, are you serious? Oh my god, do something useless, Psyduck! Stop attacking! Oh my god! Don't hit yourself! You'll die! <laughs> uh, can you use Poké Dolls? Poké Doll doesn't count, right? <laughs> With wild Pokémon. Shit! Uh. <laughs> what is with this random freaking Superman Psyduck? It hit a whole bunch of times. Why is the Psyduck so fast? Seriously, why is the Psyduck so freaking fast? <laughs> oh my god, I am actually gonna lose. I am 100% gonna lose. <laughs> this is insane. If he stays stunned for like the next five minutes, I may be able to do something. <laughs> okay, stay that way. Just stay paralyzed. Everything will be fine. Just be paralyzed. Yeah, good. <laughs> Button's just gonna... I mean, either of these will die instantly. So old birdie, it's just too low level. Fuck. Ugh. I have to try and disable it at least. Maybe I should have done this at the beginning. Okay, now just kill it! Oh, I can astonish too! Shit, probably should have astonished. Okay. It is disabled. This astonish can cause flinch. What 
the heck is going on with Diglets? Oh, I see. It's because the camera was in the ground. Because it's an incline. I'm so close. Come on. Yes! <laughs> Two survivors! Well, at least I gained a crap ton of experience. Yeah, Birdie just went, went from level 8 to level 10. Louie wants to learn to move Aqua Jet. Yes. Oh my god. Random freaking... Ugh. Uh, I don't like growl. That was... Oh my god. It's not over yet! Fuck! There's another one! I thought that was it! Fuck! Low level? Please? There's nothing I can do here. But anyways... <laughs> oh, thought it might be a one-shot. Thought a miracle was coming. No miracle. was that? I need to stay on the beaten path. Stop wandering off too far. I'm ready to get all these super powered. Ugh. You know what? No, I'm not going to count it as a failure. I'm just going to lose all the Pokemon. <laughs> that would be the fun way to do it. I lose my starter. I lose everything I've been training. Ugh. new Pokemon, apparently. There. Oh, they're all gone! Let's see, what have we got that's a decent level? Courage! I'm still going up against bugs. I have an electric type. That's good. Psychics are usually good. I'm still going to the bug gym. I don't have anything that's decent against the bug. Hey, what are you again? Rock. Right. Which I think is weak against bug. Could be wrong though. Oh, hop to it, you're coming back! <laughs> Might be my only hope against the gym leader. Cause Sackhead's not gonna do crap. Oh, it's paralyzed too. Cool. And... For water type, let's see, that's level 6. That's level 6. Necktie is pretty fast though. So, that's the new team we've got. <laughs> Oh, 
random ass trainer in the middle of nowhere. Okay, sure. Ugh. What do I want in front? <laughs> I am actually genuinely bummed. Ugh. Okay, water man. You're up front. Uh, where, am I back in the starter town? There's a ladder here. Can I actually use that? Ball. Okay, yeah, where am I? Am I just back at the yeah, I'm back in the original town. <sighs> okay, I need to turn right. So over here. No wandering, no getting distracted by shiny shit. Just make a beeline for the town. That's what I need to do. Did I fight you before? No, okay. I can get some experience here. And these Pokemon shouldn't be too terribly high level. Maybe level 10 or 11? Is it across? Okay. <clears throat> I still don't know what I'm gonna use against the gym leader. I guess I'll figure that out when I get there. Seed. Oh, an attack! This won't be that good against a bug gym. I should like stun score more than sleep powder. Just because stun spore lasts longer. Sleep powder, geez, there's a chance the Pokemon will wake up the next turn. And it just does nothing. So I'm not that big a fan of sleep powder. Drifloon. Wait, no, electric is perfect. I guess the best case scenario is that the bug gym leader has a bunch of flying bugs? I'm actually not sure if it does or not. Experience levels aren't actually doing that much worse than they were before. Like, half my Pokemon are level 10 again. A level 12, then two level 6s, but they'll catch up eventually. So I'm not that bad off right now. Don't get me wrong, I'm still pissed off, but... Not that bad. Oh, hey, a Sun Kern. Uh-huh. I 
I want Ralts to go up in level. Both level 6. Nice. Okay. What are these? Heal ball and net ball? Bugs aren't strong against fairies, are they? They shouldn't be. It's not a bug anyway, it's grass. Never mind. <laughs> I'm thinking of the gym leader. Necktie learned soak. Okay. Sunk hope. Okay. There's stuff up here. I can't not look for it. I think I'm going the right way still, anyway. See Pokemon icons on your map. Find the Pokemon in the area. Yeah, yeah. Huh? Oh, damn it, cool. Mongoose. Yeah, I think that's all the new Pokemon here. That 25 we found in the tutorial area is not going to carry through into the rest of the game. So I need to keep an eye out for trainers, just not ones with level 15 Pokemon. Oh god. This is going to go all the way bad, isn't it? Hey. I mean, it's the pre-evolved form, so it shouldn't be that high level, right? This is the baby one. Okay, you're switching. You're the highest level, so you can take the hits. Wait, flying's not strong against flying, is it? So if it uses flying attacks, this is gonna be bad for me. Come on, stun score. There we go. I have a feeling that one trainer battle is gonna just screw me up for the rest of the friggin' challenge.
I don't know. There. It's gray. Wait, they're going to the wrong boxes, aren't they? No, they shouldn't be. They should be going to the right boxes. The alive boxes. Yeah. Hey, we're refilling our army. That's good. Huh? Oh. Thought I saw something over there. Not bad. Okay, mech tie in front. You need the experience. Oh, there's a trainer over here, but I don't know if I want to go to it. I'm a little off the beaten path again. What if he just has, like, level 50 Pokemon? I mean, it's a... The, Poke the wild Pokemon here aren't that high level. So his shouldn't be that much higher, right? Let's do it! I need the experience anyway. I'm not gonna beat the gym leader like this. Like, it was kind of questionable before. Now it's just... No. There is zero chance. I have nothing that is good. Well, good against bugs, I mean. I have some okay Pokemon here, but they're low level and they're not strong against bugs. I mean, I'll win eventually. So sparkly, I got distracted. Where the heck am I going right now? Right, I think I just went backwards. Yeah, I totally just went in like a big old circle. No more wandering, just go. Heal. <laughs> Heal first. Good, you can stop taking way longer than you need to. Let you know the way to one of the ten sites of Paldea. Sergio, the office worker.
Is that ground poison or water poison? I think it's ground poison. So I should still be able to waste it pretty easily. Except I don't have any water attacks. That's cool. A water type with the water attacks. Perfect. Okay, let's switch. Akuhita is actually not bad. So if I use it again, will it just not hit? Yeah, okay. I don't know if I've ever used that move before. Right, it'll die eventually. God! Basic trainers are giving me so much freaking trouble here. That's why they oh, that's why I call it a challenge. about something. It's lowers the special attack of opposing Pokemon. God, it's 55 power. Bone Claws. Attack and accuracy. That's pretty good. Very weird selection of moves, isn't it? Hey, this is stronger, so... Sight I've never seen. Okay. Wait, is it even like stuff on the ground respawning? There's no way I didn't get that before. I think stuff just keeps continually respawning on the ground. Please heal me. Hey, if nothing else, this challenge does force me to use a lot of Pokemon I don't usually use. Which is neat. It's very, very neat. I'm not at all bitter about the way that battle went. It's very, very neat. Gimmick goal would be pretty any good in this challenge. <coughs> Excuse me. Electro ball. He's just gonna... Ugh. Well, you have a ghost move. Let's put you in front. I don't remember what level Gimme Ghoul is at. Hopefully not too terribly high. Level 10. Okay. Not bad.
Don't go crazy. Those rattled speed rows. to normal type attacks this early in the game is probably pretty good though because most pokemon focus on normal attacks this early lots of mammals that remove cotton spore what is cotton spore these cotton like spores that cling to opposing pokemon lowers speed i don't want to lower speed Yeah, I don't care about speed that much, so, no. Okay. Sometimes it gets left in shop corners since no one realizes it's actually a Pokemon. I might want to bring it with me. A ghost, again, could be pretty handy. Let's see, I want to level up Brawls, because Gardevoir is actually really good. I know internet and everything, but Gardevoir is genuinely a good Pokemon to have. So I want a water Pokemon, an electric Pokemon. I'm still not sure about Hop to it, but it's the highest level I have. So it seems I would want it for the gym battle regardless. I think I might just get rid of Necktie. Yeah, maybe I'll, yeah, drop Necktie for now. I thought that was an item. <laughs> it's a Pokemon. It's just a really, really tiny Pokemon. Alright, the wild Pokemon are still around within my level range, so that's a good sign. I swear I hear a Gimmigul, but where? Oh, are you a Gimmigool? You are a Gimmigool. Alright. see, are there any more Pokemon I can catch? Oh. Cricketot! Alright. Ten game character model has appeared. Very important to me, my character model never disappears. Yeah. Aha. Get much for it, but I'll take it. It works as a nickname, I guess. 
No, I should have named it Jiminy. Oh, well, I don't care that much. <laughs> Unless everything else dies, I'm probably not going to be using it. Which is a distinct possibility, actually. Oh, it's a terrestrialized Pokemon. I'm not going to be worrying too much about that. Like, I'm not that worried about the special terrestrialization forms. I do like them. Like, I like the idea of a form that has access to more stuff than normal. You know what I mean? That can change its type. It's a very cool concept. I'm just not too worried about it. I'm more of a collector than a, like, competitive battler or anything. Oh, what are you? Do I already have you? Do I already have you? Yes, let's go ahead. Okay. Wasn't sure. It looked like a pre-evolution of one I have, but no, it's the same one. Oh shit, I'm not I'm not even gonna try it. I am not tackling Vesper Queen. I know it's gonna be like level 30 and it's gonna waste me. Apparently evolved Pokemon are just higher level than the others. That's just how it is. Didn't I see a trainer over here somewhere? I could use a trainer battle. Get some experience and money. Check me out, I'm 60 and still kicking. I'm even off to take on a gym. Manuel, the student. I'm 60 and getting beat before I even get to the gym. Adamantment. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I don't just respawn at random. That's another palmy. Okay. Jiggly, I'll have to go back for that in a minute. I wonder if that song's copyrighted. The Jigglypuff tune. Might be. <laughs> The MCA, you sang Jigglypuff. I mean, anytime you say the word Jigglypuff, you're breaking the MCA. Oh no, it disappeared. I know you were here. Jigglypuff. Oh, there you are, Jigglypuff. But is it going to be high enough level to kick my ass? That's the question. At least it's a wild Pokemon, so I can poke it all if it is. If it isn't, I can catch it and use it. Level 10. Nice. Okay. Very good. Woo! Put him 
inflates to sing a lullaby, it can perform longer and cause sure drowsiness in its audience. Now, do I want to bring it? I don't want a whole bunch of normal type Pokemon, so it's either Courage or Jigglypuff. And Courage is just stronger right now, so I'm... Okay, maybe I'll just leave Piggly Jeff for now. <laughs> you can stay there. Oh yeah, there's a thing over here. Nice. Hello. Can I catch that? Oh, hey! I can already swim in the pool. Oh, is that why there's a swimming animation? So if I go in there with just the trainer, will it actually do the swimming animation? No. So why does he have a swimming animation, then? Probably left over from Legends Arceus. Oh, yeah. I didn't get the... Probably can get the reward from over here. Having some nice battles? Oh, Brock, give me my stuff. I'm a Pokemon League rep. I'm having some nice Pokemon battles. We do need five trainers here in Area 2 of the South Province. On behalf of the Pokemon League, here's your lovely prize. Well, that's actually super good. I need a flying move. That's probably why they give it to you here. But I'm not questioning it. Anything you... <laughs> Of course, Hop to it can learn it. <laughs> oh, that's kind of funny. At least it gets stabbed. What is Hop to its attack? Probably like one. Fifteen. Not great, but okay. It's one of the worst in the group. So yeah, not great. But it is an air move. It is a flying type move. I should probably be saving more often. Even if I'm not save scumming, I should be saving. What the hell? Oh. He wants to get a fancy shot of the Pokemon League building. The gym! That's what they're called. Oh, hey! New Moon! Came to see this gym, huh? That can only mean one thing. You're out to earn some gym badges and take on the Pokemon League, aren't you? Yes! I knew it! I'm so glad I asked you to do it. Before you can battle a gym leader, you've got to pass a certain challenge set by them. Their gym test. Every gym's test is different. If you ask the lobby staff about it, they'll tell you what's up. Here, have these. When you use them, consider me healing up your Pokemon. I'm so glad you're aiming to be a champion, too. This is the best news ever. Man, I'm so excited, I can barely stand still. Guess I'll go battle every trainer I run into. Welcome to the Cortando Gym. Let me register you as a challenger. Your name is Newmoon, yes? Great. Now, in order to face gym leader Katie, you'll first need to pass the gym test. Here at the Cortando Gym, that means taking on the Olive Roll. Olive production is a big part of life in Cortando. We've held the Olive Harvest Festival here each year for generations to usher in bumper crops. To pass our gym test, you'll need to roll an olive-shaped ball all the way to the goal. Your efforts should help ensure we get a great Olive Harvest next year, too. The staffer over at the Olive Rolling Field will explain the rules to you in further detail. A registered location in your map app. It's just to the north of town. Now get out there and have fun! 
<sighs> okay. Can you give me something useful, please? Jeff ended up rolling a small one instead of the olive ball. I'm pretty sure there's a difference. Halloween store? What is this? What's with the spider webs? Alright, I'm not gonna question it. I guess I did just question it, but they can do what they want. Yep, this is the place for me. Oh, here, give me a ghoul. Pretty sure that's gonna be cool. Oh yeah, there we go. I think. Oh no. There's small ones out there talking. Okay. Whee! Oh, it's over here, okay. Welcome to the olive rolling field. This gym test is all about stamina. You'll need to push with all you've got to get a large olive ball rolling and make it all the way to the end. Get the ball over various obstacles, then push it into the goal to clear the course. Now that you're all filled in, are you ready to start the gym test? Great, put in a wish for a good olive harvest and roll, roll, roll away. I actually don't know what level the trainers here are. I'm going to fight you no matter what. Let's see. Courage! Yeah. I'll open up a short court for you. It's worth for for you. If you manage to bleed me. Let's see if you can get past my wall of small of. We call it the wall of. We're challenged by gym trainer Esmeralda. That's Cricketoon. Alright, I should be able to win this. so strong all right I can heal outside of battle so as long as I can win this battle I'll be okay uh, no sack heads weak against bugs Water I mean, Oscar is strong against. Does it have bug type moves? I don't know! He's immune to tackle! And that's all he's used. Yeah, he's not even going to use Tackle. I think this was a good move. I mean, even if it takes a while, he'll die eventually. 
But yeah, he's not attacking anymore. I think that was a good call. all day to actually kill it. My attack is going to be in the gutter. Now the gimmick goal has very good attack in the first place. God, how low can it go? Tackle. I might need my astonishes later. Yeah, just tackle a bit. He <laughs> will die. I promise he will die. That's exactly what I needed. Yes. Don't mind me, let's learn learn hypnosis. Nice. Make the target fall asleep. Not great, but probably better actually I don't know, double team's pretty good too. Disarming voice and confusion. Good combo. Oh, it's okay. It's a uh, thing is fairy, so I'm gonna get rid of growl. Yeah, double team is actually pretty good in a lot of situations. I didn't even know Ralts could learn that. Looks like you're headed right past my small of wall. Okay, team small of time to clear the way. It is kind of funny, this is the bug gym leader, but everything in the challenge is plant related. Alright, I'm gonna put Don't Mind Me up front. And if I look like, if it looks like I can kill something, because a lot of bugs are also poison type. And Poison is weak to Psychic, so she might actually be able to kill something. Waiting for a shortcut, you gotta earn it. Not even pass me easily. No, I'll see, though. Is Venom that Poison? I don't know, but it's level 13. Shit. Okay, courage. Of course. Also, Venonat is freaking huge! Why is it so big? Scary face do again? Lower speed. Don't care. Whoa. 
Sure, why not? Nice. No more confusion. Paralyze it! Really, are we playing that game here? Nice, got the paralysis. Yeah, this is like a it's like a stall deck in Magic the Gathering. One of those blue decks that you absolutely hate playing against. Lick! It's hung! No, not quite. Probably should have switched it out. Oh, well, I chose my path. Nice. Paralyzed. I just realized Venonat's eyes aren't shaded at all. I mean, it makes sense. Eyes don't really get shading, but... I don't know. There's something weirdly awkward about it. I just don't want Courage in there while he's poisoned. God, I hate these kind of Pokemon. Yeah, what are you going to disable? I didn't use anything. It's your fault for confusing me. Woo! Um, I should just win next turn. Just learn to move bite. Bite and crunch are tend to be pretty good. Yeah, 60, 100, and may flinch. Very good. Uh, attack is way higher than special attack. So. And that's good for things that are. No, get rid of scary face. Fuck scary face. Force Palm. Alright, 60, 100. They also leave the target with Paralysis. So it's just strictly better than Arm Thrust. Fake out. So that's just a guaranteed 40 hit. 100 accuracy makes the enemy flinch. It's just like, it's like a free little boop. A free boop. You didn't even see me do that. A free boop. Whatever. <laughs> and sand attack. Sand attack is pretty good anyway. Uh, do I want focus energy? I think force palm is better than arm thrust. I swear, it sounds like there's a ghost in my headset. I'm pretty sure it's just a Pokemon sound somewhere. <laughs> it's like something going... Yeah. Your mighty will blew right past me after all. Even the small of can tell how strong you are. They'll step aside for you now. I'm 
glad I have the small of approval. Now the question is, do I try the gym leader? Because if I lose to this gym leader, I don't know if I can recover. Uh, game? There we go. With that performance, I'm sure I can look forward to a great olive harvest next year. I'm happy to declare your gym test officially cleared. Congratulations! Please report your results to the lobby staffer at the gym. Good luck in your battle against Katie. Okay. Uh, do I have the cinnamon dog? I think I have one. Yeah. Pokemon hurt? When your Pokemon are hurt, heal them. When you see a shop, buy up supplies. Those habits are key to happy adventure. I'd like to heal. Now, I think the bugs will be weak enough to where this will be okay, though. Bugs are not strong. It's the first gym. Courage is level 14, which is pretty decent. My biggest problem is, again, that I don't really have any good stab moves that are super effective against them. Unless there are some poison types mixed in there. And even then, Rolf is pretty low level. So unless you gain some quick levels... I mean, I'm not destined for failure, I'll put it that way. I'm not definitely lost. Where's the psychic? Oh, flying, that's how you need. Nobody can use any flying. I can't make anything anyway. <laughs> I'm not getting materials. Alright, should I just go for it? I'm just gonna go for it. And there's not much more I can do to prepare. <sighs> I'm going for all out of fence using a Pokemon that's strong as bug types. Good for you. Welcome back, New Moon. I hear you're on a roll out there. A big congratulations from me for successfully clearing the gym test. You now earn the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck! Are you ready to challenge gym leader Katie, the sugar bug? Very well, I'm going to show you to the battle court. My cute little Vivalon. Oh, what a lovely trainer you are. Thank you very much for your skillful olive rolling. It was quite impressive. Oh, would I be able to introduce myself? Forgive me. My name is Katie. And I am the owner here at Patisserie Patisser Soapberry. Oh, that's right. I'm not in my shop. I'm on duty as leader of the Corfondo Gym right now. Forgive me. <clears throat> my name is Katie. I am the gym leader here in Corfondo. My main line of work is crafting sweets as a pastry chef. 
Little sweets that bring happiness with just one bite. Bug type Pokemon hiding in foliage. Both are small, yet very powerful. Don't let your guard down unless you would like to find yourself knocked off your feet. Okay, I sh this should be okay, hopefully. Don't take my bug type Pokemon lightly. You'll be in for a world of pain if you do. 14, 14. Okay. Bite. Super effective. Wait, what? Is Courage actually dark type? I thought he was normal. I didn't know what the, this Pokemon was. I probably should have checked. Tarantula. Okay. Scared hit by a dark ghost or bug type attack or if intimidated, which boosts its speed stat. Huh, interesting. Or bug type attack. Oof. I'm not sure what Toronto. Oh, it okay, that is dark. I thought it was normal. If I knew that, I would have played this totally differently. Let's see, I'm choosing between Hop to it and Oscar. I kind of want to save Hop to it for the final Pokemon. Well, maybe Oscar would be better then. Let's do this. How many Pokemon does she have? I didn't even check. Okay, it is neutral. So apparently flying is actually strong against the bug type. That was a productive turn. Oh, is it poison type? Is that why it can't be poisoned? This can work, but just keep everything paralyzed. Yeah. I thought that would kill it. Ooh, now we've got a gamble. Should have hit. Oh, okay. Whew. Teddy Ursa, okay. This is the last Pokemon. I don't think Teddy Ursa. Teddy Ursa should only have normal moves, right? Teddy Ursa is a normal type. Normally. So it shouldn't have any bug moves or anything. If that's correct, I should be able to stall it out with Gimmigool. Let's hope. Oh, 
You're quite good, aren't you? How should I roll things out from here? If I can keep astonishing. Now, my little Pokemon, time to break free from your cocoon and come into your own. Eyes and my shining bug decoration. Oh, this one is not so sweet. Ugh. Yeah, Fury Cutter is bug type. Sacrificing, I might be. Not my first choice, but if I started switching around, everything would be dying. What has higher hit rate? Sun score is 75, Thunder Wave is 90. Of course, that's assuming it's faster than Teddy Ursa, which it might not be. Huh. Static? No. I lose. It's like all around. Barring something incredibly weird happening. Oh, one shot without even a crit. this thing. Fifteen? It's not even that high. Why is it so fast? That's okay. We're learning lessons. <laughs> We're definitely learning. gonna get swept by Teddy Ursa. Definitely doesn't matter. Hey, sure, yeah, it definitely outspeeds me. Four times effective, too. Psychic and fairy. <sighs> I 
were overwhelmed by your defeat. So you don't white out, you just kind of go, oh shit. Oh, shut up. Is there, I mean, Piggly Guff Jeff isn't that bad. Maybe I can evolve that eventually. I feel like it's basically over already. <laughs> like, I definitely can't win the gym now. If I had just kept fighting the battles and stuff, I probably could have stood a chance after like a little, like came forward and just fight a couple more trainers. That's all I needed to do. A couple more trainers, I probably could have won that. Like it's not like this is undoable. It's not like I can't do this. I just didn't. I'm not giving up. I'm not flying, yeah. I should always have two bugs. Probably not good. Wiggleman. Uh, necktie, come back. Okay. Not trying the trainer again. The gym again, that's for sure. But thankfully, it is an open world game, so there's plenty to do. What is this? Yeah, if I go back and go down this way, there should be more stuff. Path of Legends, Sony Cliff Titan. So what are these? Hmm. There's some stuff here. I don't actually know what it is. Oh, is that the Pokemon League up there? Oh, huh. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know what those, uh, like, type markers are. Gym badge, psychic. Yeah, that's not happening. Yeah, without resounding defeat, there's... Uh, I don't even know what else I can do. I guess move on and try to find some trainers to fight. I kind of expected to lose a couple Pokemon. I did not expect to get completely swept twice in a row. That has probably just ended the whole challenge right there. Because that blows so much experience out of the water. Hey, you're new. helpful. Gray learned wing attack. Nice. Okay. So I don't think it's, it's not over yet. 
It's not completely over. It's not hopeless. more good catches like oh shit ghastly I don't want to do anyway this is one I might actually want to use to learn sweet kiss. Despite lacking substance, it can develop an opponent of any size and cause suffocation. Now, if I'd done this before, I probably would have won. Just realized I have two water types. Get out of here, Wiggleman. What are you? Oh shit, Miss Ravis. going to be huge. If I can get it to a decent enough level. This is her final Pokemon is level 15. I need Gray to be at least level 15 at that point. Possible. Stockpile? I always forget what stockpile does. It's a very complicated move. Stores power and boosts defense and special defense stat. Okay, it's not that complicated. <laughs> move can be used up to three times. Let's see. What else does it have? Covet? It has no fairy moves. It steals the target's held item. Echoed voice, that seems good. Pound and disable. Disable on a Teddy Ursa would be pretty good, actually. What would it even do? That was the only move it used. Okay, so I don't think it needs pound. Echoed voice is good enough. Bit up. Power stored using the move stockpiles. Released at once in the attack. The more power is stored, the greater the move's power. Uh, probably covet. Oh my god, all the moves. Why did they turn Jigglypuff into Gulpin? Power stored using move stockpiles absorbed by the user to restore its own HP. The more power is stored, the more HP is restored. Um So a heal or a shot? I guess that's the choice here. I think I would rather have Well no, because the stockpile increases defense and special defense. Then you heal it all up and start echoed voicing. So I think I would rather have Swallow than Spit Up. Like I know Jigglypuff is basically just a giant lung, but... I mean... 
It really is just a dog. use all these Pokemon just because of their levels. Like, these are way better leveled than the ones I'm being forced to use now. Like, obviously. shot. I get too overzealous though. Yeah, okay. No. No. I could die if it attacks again. No, not Confuse Ray. I hate Confuse Ray so much. Probably my least favorite move in the entire franchise. I hate Confuse Ray so much. confused. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I'm not doing that. Anyone else would probably just die immediately. Thank you! Oh my god. good at least. If you lose against a wild Pokemon, you get the option to just leave. Okay. So you, and you're gone now. Because this seems like it could be okay. I actually don't remember how Bug and Rock relate to each other. Might have to look it up later. We're like... Wait, that's grass. That's not good. Yeah, the new Pokemon I'm getting are the ones that I'll definitely want to use. I just need to level them up a little. Because this team is looking way better already. I don't remember how Combi evolves. Trainer. Am I just gonna die to the trainer? Possibly. Let's find out. <laughs> I see you're around school. You're that new transfer student, aren't you? Really? 
he's gonna get absolutely schooled by a bird. You know what? Swap out. There's no reason Doggo shouldn't be good. It's flying, I think flying fire. Rock is good against both of those, so. Unless he gets burned. It didn't. Ah! It's really shaking things up. Oh, is that Fampy? It's Fampy. Nice. Let's see. I'll put gray out front and then switch it out. So I need the bird to be a little bit stronger. What are the odds of it getting one-shotted? Probably pretty good. Fampy is either rock or ground. Or both. They tend to like doing rock and ground. Oh, these moves. Holy shit. Come on, really? Oh, okay. Things aren't looking as bad as I thought they were. Still looking terrible. I really should have gotten up there before I challenged Gym Leader. I knew challenging Gym Leader right away was a bad idea. My Pokemon were way too low level for that. And I had zero good stab against bugs, which is amazingly stupid for me to try that. Like, holy crap. I know I'm doing like this weird wonky challenge and all, but there was no reason for that. We're looking better now, though. We are. We have some, you know, Godago Fluffy. Hopefully things won't go quite so bad next time. Lose a dozen Pokemon in one video. Not many mus Muzlocks you can say that about, huh? For now, I will return at some point. Later!